This is Scott Bach Hansen, and I wanted to share this video with you. Um, many of us today are are hurting. Um, we are awaiting word that our our friend, our family member, our coach, our leader, uh, Dave Scooter Skaggs, is uh, getting ready to make the journey uh, out of this lifetime and into heaven. And it's been a long road for Scooter, and I know that there's a lot of people that are that are hurting. But um, I've had the chance to share this message uh, from a church pulpit. Um, I've been a guest speaker at many events, and you know I just wanted to share this video with you. So many many people may have heard this story or watched my sermon that was posted um, by JD earlier um, as they watched it together. Uh, with Scooter in his uh, in his room, but <clears throat> the lessons that Scooter taught us were much more than just phrases, and there were many phrases. <laughs> we we can all laugh about that, but I wanted to share this video with you because this this was really the the most life changing moment for me. Um, in this video, uh, we are in the last year of Woodward High School, so this is the last soccer team. Uh, in, at high school level that Scooter coached. So um, he was uh, always uh, somebody that really um, enjoyed the competition, but really enjoyed developing young men. And in this video, we're playing our arch rival, Walter Johnson, and this is in the regional final, and the loser goes home. The, the season's over, pack your uniforms up, and it's over. And we are in, in this game in sudden death overtime. The score is one-to-one, -one, and... In this video, um, we've we've spent a whole week of getting uh, really fired up to play Walter Johnson. They had just beat us a couple of weeks earlier. Um, they had momentum, and uh, but we had the heart of a champion. Not that they didn't, but sometimes we get the right uh, bounces, the lucky breaks, whatever you may call it. Um, but I wanna I wanna show you this video because it really shows uh, the lesson that I learned. From Scooter. So, uh, a sudden death overtime, and what you're going to see is a pass is going to go uh, down the wing here. Um, and Carl Colback uh, is going to take a shot on goal. And uh, a bounce goes the wrong way and ends up in the back of the net, and we begin celebrating. And uh, Walter Johnson's kids are devastated. And I'm going to. I'm going to pause it right here because I want you to just pay attention. We have cheerleaders running on the field, we're running in all di different directions. We are celebrating. This is a, a big win, um, our, our biggest rival, and we were able to pull out the victory. But <clears throat> what's coming next is really what the lesson is all about. Um, as I am running, and this is me here, in the background you see this gentleman running here. That's Scooter. And Scooter is not running out to celebrate with us, okay? Okay. Uh, Scooter is running to go console the goalkeeper who just had a bad bounce and the ball run through his legs. He doesn't even stop to celebrate. He's only concerned about the young man who just had this happen to him and is going to live with that play for a long time. That's what Scooter teaches us. He shows compassion in the midst of Crazy celebration in a time where we're all celebrating, and we're celebrating for him, too. And he teaches us the ultimate lesson, and that's that he was the first one to their goalie. He was the first one to console him. You know, we celebrate. My coach is on his knees right here, consoling the goalkeeper. It's something that I'll never forget. It's something that, a lesson that will live with me forever. And I hope that as I share this lesson with others, that you too can appreciate the man that Dave Skaggs is and was and will continue to be in our memories forever. Scoot, we love you, brother.